Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Okay, it has been a heck of a long time since I have posted a video and I honestly do not deserve your guys' love. I'm so unworthy and I appreciate all the messages and I promise I am totally okay. I'm not dying sick or anything like that. I've actually been really well and healthy. I've just, life you guys has been so insane and I hope that this camera angle is okay. I spent like 20 minutes trying to find a good angle and I just was watching Andrea's latest video. Well, I guess, I don't know if it's her newest one, but where she was showing the new planners and I was like, I need to plan like you guys. I have not planned. It is such a long story and you guys deserve an explanation. So I thought, why not just start up my plan with me because I'm really, really feeling it and I just need something to get me out of my funk and get me back into it. And I really hope you guys aren't hating me and forgive me and there's so much I want to say and so much I want to do and so many stickers and shops I want to show you guys so let's just get into it and we can start talking so pardon me my nails yeah whatever who cares anyway this kit is really old <laughs> I've been saving this kit for a year. I literally probably bought this a year ago. This is a really old Shop Jessica Hearts kit. One of the first kits I ever fell in love with and it is her beach day and I thought, you know what, let's just kick it off with something I've been saving and loving and that is really gonna get me in the mood. So I am gonna pre-plan for Mother's Day and I love my mama and we are beach loving babes and me, my mom and my sister. So I thought, let's use this kit and have some fun. So I, when I got this kit, she also used to do these decorative fonts that you could get that match the kit. Oh, I got like, ooh, like ink or something on my hand, sorry. Um, so I'll try to use those, they're really, really cute. So in this kit, you get all of your headers. I'm not gonna use any glitter heads, I'm just gonna try to stick with this kit and maybe pull a few in. Um, you get two weekend banners. I love these little drawn like star heart checklists, little ombres. Um, you have day covers, half, half boxes. Oh my gosh, it's been so long, this actually feels like weird. Ooh, I love it. <laughs> um, some deco, you get your little, some icons. I just, I love her kits. She's like my one of my favorite shops, you guys know that if you've been around for a while. Um, your washi, and this is all in glossy, by the way, and then your adorable full boxes, so. Okay, <clears throat> let's start by putting down our washi. Oh my gosh, what the heck? I feel like every time I film something, I work so hard to like get my desk clean, and then my nails get covered in like ink, so. I am so sorry. Um, as you guys know, I've been working at a pediatric dental hygienist off or dental office. Oh my gosh, I feel like so nervous. I'm sorry if I mess up so much in this video. Um, and I really, really love working with kids. I really, really love my job for so long. And when you work in a job like that, you have to understand that the type of patients we see aren't just like everyday kids usually. Like we did see that too, but 90, no, maybe not that many, maybe like 75% of our patients had um, certain needs, whether it be with their health, their mental health, um, they would have severe decay, like really specific things that just couldn't be treated at a dental office came to us. Like we did sedations, we did general anesthetic, um, not in office, like at the hospitals, we did like local, or um, like other types of sedation in office. Like we really did difficult cases. So it was a very busy, very high stress job. Um, not one I didn't love by any means, but it was like, very just yeah crazy um and just being in that environment started to take a toll on me not saying it's anyone i worked with's fault like i'm gonna just keep laying stickers you guys look how fat this planner is oh my god it's just that when you're in i'm so, how do i explain this so just to be like real for a minute, like this is gonna be like probably a deep video. So this is like me bearing my soul to you guys cause I just like need you to understand. Like I feel just like such a terrible person you guys for the last like two months. I think it's been like two months since I posted a video. And yes, pineapple cover is back. I've just been like so anxious and feeling so guilty about like not posting a video just because this is what I love. But I felt guilty not giving you guys an explanation but it's just so hard with the state I was in anyway. I feel just like I'm all over the place. I'm gonna just start putting full boxes down randomly. Um, I'm gonna put two up here for a weekend banner. So, I was working in this very high stress job and I myself am a very anxious person. person. Um, I'm not afraid to admit that I take like medications for anxiety and stress and I don't do well 
over long periods of time, like no one probably does, like in high stress. But for me personally, something that might not be stressful for someone where you're in certain situations is more stressful for me, which is probably pretty common, but I didn't realize how hard this job was taking a toll on me. And I was getting so anxious, so almost depressed. Like it felt like I was just waking up every single day. Ooh, crud, why did I do that? Oh, crud. Oh good, it's just the uh, sidebar. Oh my goodness. Sorry guys, you see what I did? I like ripped it up really quick because I wasn't paying attention. Thank goodness the sidebar is what ripped. Not her beautiful stickers. Um, I just would wake up and I was so upset and unfortunately mm. like I just couldn't handle it anymore and I had to leave my job and that that's like really summarizing it. Like several events had happened at this point and it just like wasn't I wasn't in a good mental state. I just had trouble getting out of bed because it just physically hurt me to go to work and it sucked. And what also really hurt me more was that I loved my job. It's so hard to, to explain that, you know, that you love your job so much, but it drains you. It just literally, like, I would go to work and I would come home and I would be so beat. It would just take all my energy to eat dinner and not pass out because my body just was fighting me going to that office. Like, fight or flight, you know, why are you going back to something that's causing you so much stress? Um, and I don't wanna talk about people or situations or anything like that, and there was definitely stuff like that involved, but I had to do what was, Jeez, Louise, I'm a little upset with this that it's not cut, but I think it might just be because these stickers are like a year old, so let's be real. Um, I should have used this sooner. So I eventually did it, and within 24 hours, you guys, I can't even tell you how good I felt. It was like weight had lifted off my shoulders, the world was happy again, and since then, I've been lucky enough to be offered several jobs, and I just feel so good about myself, and I finally feel like I'm getting back on my feet. And I just want to say that, you guys, I know it's so cheesy and corny, but never feel you're tied down at any job. No matter how happy you think you may be, look for signs that you're not happy to. Like, really listen to your body. And Because I'm someone who ignored the signals of my body was upset and stressed out with me. I'm someone, if you guys would know me, you would see me as someone who's always happy. You know, I'm always showing a smile whether I'm happy or not. That's just the kind of person I am, which you guys probably sense from my really bubbly personality, which I'm sure you can. That's just how I am. So it's really hard for me to sometimes turn that off even when I get off work. It's just like I'm trying to be so happy, but really my body's telling me I'm not, if that makes sense, you know? Anyway, I just, I really want to apologize to you guys. I really like fell off the map for a while there and I'm gonna try to get myself back in because I hadn't even been planning like planning is a passion of mine as you guys know like I love this this is so much to me and this is something that does help me when I'm anxious and when I get too anxious I don't want to do anything if anyone else like struggles with mental health not that you need to share anything but I feel like me sharing this with you guys might help someone else feel better and even if it helps one other person feel better in a situation they may be in, it's enough for me. I'm not afraid to admit that I have anxiety and mental health, um, mental health, like I don't know, I don't want to say disorder because it's, you know, it's just mental, I have mental health problems, like it's not a problem, it's just how, who I am and it's who you may be too so I hope that by telling you guys my story that it'll shed some light on the situation and maybe help you out in yours. Not saying, you know, go leave your job, you know, it's, that's definitely not it, but you know, make sure what you're doing is still making you happy. At the end of the day, life's too short and we can't just sit around and do things that don't make us happy because in my opinion, then you just waste your time. <laughs> but I feel like I've just had this like motivational speech and you guys probably think I'm some weirdo now, so I'm so sorry if that just like, was not what you were looking for in a plant with me video, but I hope you guys understand. Um, but I feel so much better, you guys. And I've started a new job and I can't even tell you how happy I am. It's just like everything has fallen into place again and I finally feel like, I don't wanna say like life's worth living, but I'm happy to go to work, you know? Like 
there's a the point where you just don't even want to go. You don't want to go anywhere. But I'm happy to say, like, all of that has gone away, and I just feel like myself again. And I just want to thank you guys for always supporting me, no matter what. And constantly, you know, sending me messages, sending me comments, and all that. And I love you guys so much, so thank you. Um, anywho, we should just move on with the plan with me. <laughs> I feel like I might just, actually, do I want to use these? Yeah, I really do. They're so gorgeous. Um, I'm going to, like, try to color block with the um, bull boxes. Oh, I should have put a header down maybe. Eh, let's see. Anyways, so what have you guys been up to? Me, obviously nothing. I honestly like haven't even watched plan with me videos. Like that's how bad I've been. Part of me like, I don't know, it felt almost, it gave me anxiety to watch videos because I would feel so guilty that I wasn't putting up videos. And I just feel so out of the loop, like I have no idea and I honestly am just like <sighs> So it's just interesting because this kit is really like a year old and I feel like maybe the boxes in the old planner were like slightly shorter, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure that was like a big dilemma. But I can't remember because there is some white space and I don't think it's me, but it could have been me. Let's be real. I was also inspired because like Andrea did that layout when I was watching her just like flip through her planner with that old Hawaii um, deco that was like big last year that Glam Planner did. And I remember I wanted that kit so freaking bad, but never ended up getting it. And right now it's just like the... Canadian dollar sucks. I'm not buying stickers from the States. I love, like, I just, I love you guys so much, but I just, I cannot afford it. Like, mostly stickers in general, I know I can't afford, so please forgive me. But, um, I just remember I used to want that kit so bad, and I never got it, but just watching her made me remember how much I love planning. It's just weird how something like that can, like, make you want to, you know, get up and just do it. Do you know what I mean? You guys know what I mean. So, yeah. Um... I don't have much planned this week, but you know, you guys get the impulse sometimes, you just gotta plan. Actually, that kind of worked out nice. I actually really am liking how this turning is out. I sh is turning out. I should put a weekend banner down before it's too late. I hope this isn't too zoomed out, you guys. Let me know. Um, I know I, I'm just kind of planning differently. I'm kind of just doing what I feel. And it just feels so right. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> and pardon me, I kind of have like that annoying, oh, I need headers, ma'am. I need them headers. I've got that annoying cough that like everybody has and working in the healthcare industry. Like, you know how people are like, it just never goes away. You're like, yeah, try working in the healthcare industry. Literally, you're like diagnosed with a cough for the rest of your life. Like, hello, it sucks. Um, yeah, so I have had this permanent cough for like the last six months and it's just like not attractive. Like, how does Paul still kiss me? I don't know, but he loves it. <laughs> like, what is wrong with me? <laughs> you guys missed this, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> Not. <laughs> Who wouldn't? Just kidding. I missed you guys more, honestly. I miss talking to you guys. I really do. Ow! That just, like, ripped the hair. <laughs> like, ain't even fun having that happen. Maybe I didn't miss you planning. Not you guys planning. Just kidding. I love you, I love you, I love you. Oh my god, I'm getting like weird. <laughs> this is getting to be the weirdest, most random plan thing I think I've ever filmed. I really hope this has been like in focus. Sorry if it gets like blurry. You guys know I've had like camera troubles. Well, you probably don't know. Unless you've watched my last few videos, which has been a while. So I'm just gonna kinda start to put headers down. I'm gonna do some more color blocking. I love this kit. It's just so beachy and summery, and I know it's spring, but today was the first day in six months I saw in the news here in Calgary that it got over 20 degrees Celsius. Yeah, it's pretty, uh, pretty sad. But, like, I literally, like, it wasn't even hitting 20 degrees yet. I walk outside of my, like, I just got a new job, and I walk outside the office because it's downtown. There's some girl in like a bra and short shorts and it's like still 15 degrees. I'm like, okay, I think we're pushing it, Calgary. Like, let's like pump the brakes. Like, it always happens. Like, I'll be on the C train and then there's like someone and it's like z above zero for the first time in the winter and they're wearing shorts and you're like, I can't. <laughs> 
Hashtag Alberta problem. <laughs> Uh, so you guys want to hear a crazy story about my nails now that I've been done being serious I'm more into having fun about this plan with me. So I Wanted to just put like a clear coat because I used to have shellac, but let's be real I peeled them off because I couldn't stand it anymore and was too lazy to go get my nails done So I just peeled it off So I decided last night just to paint it clear and then I don't know I was using this like new nail polish my friend Lindsay got me and it's from Scotland because she's from Scotland and it's like really crazy good like clear polish. I don't know what it is. I'll have to like go look later, but um, I put it on first and I was like, no, I think I want color. So I painted them like the ox blood red and I was like so into it. And I like went to work today and I took off my glove when I was like cleaning and like my nail had completely like peeled off. Like the clear coating didn't let anything stick, which probably does happen, but I don't know. And then I was able to Honestly, just go punk, 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 and peeled off every single nail. That's why you kind of see a little bit of, like, red around my nails. It was like, holy shiza. <laughs> it was kind of, why did I tell you guys that? Like, sorry, who cares? <laughs> uh, anyway, um, I'm just trying to think. So I work Monday next week and Thursday, and I'm going to say, t actually, I don't know about Tuesday. For sure these two days. But I got, like, two part-time jobs, so... They both could turn into a full time. Um, so one's Monday and Thursday, one's just Tuesday. But the Tuesday one doesn't start till I want to say the week after this. So yeah, on like the 23rd, I think. Yeah. So, um, but I might be filling in in the meantime. We'll see. So you guys can watch and find out. Let's do today. Oh, those date covers for the the date covers for this kit are really really cute too. I'm sorry, I know I'm like probably sounding so jumbled and just so like I can't pronounce anything. So, oh, good save, but it's been a while. I'm kind of like nervous to film to be honest. <laughs> like, ah. but I love you guys and I know you all support me. I hope. <laughs> Anyway, oh my gosh, I love this kit. It's so pretty, it's so gorgeous. Yeah, like look you guys, how sad. Ugh, I'm so embarrassed, but honestly, like anxiety is, it's anxiety, you guys. I honestly feel for anyone else who ever has to struggle with it. I really do. I'm here for you guys, I really am. Please know you're not alone. I just love when people, you guys have heard me say this a hundred times, put something other than a heart on the ombre heart checklist. I like love that she used stars. These stars are just so cute. Okay, I'm debating if I want white space or not. We'll see. Hmm. Oh, I gotta figure out what to do for Mother's Day. I wonder what my mom will want to do. Now, Kendra's probably not gonna be here because she does live in Lethbridge, but she was just here, like she just left on Monday. Today, by the way, just so we know, is the fourth is when I'm filming this. Kendra was here and she left on Monday. Oh my gosh, tomorrow's Cinco de Mayo and today was May the 4th, so that means tomorrow is, so may the 4th be with you. The Lord of the Fifth, I think I heard someone say. It's like the Lord of the Sith, but it's not as good. I don't remember. I'm just trying to think about it and it doesn't sound right. <laughs> okay, keep going, Jessica. Just keep putting down stickers, that's good. Um, sometimes I get like nervous talking to like patients and I just like will overthink it so much that it comes out so weird like right now I feel like I'm really overthinking it and that's why everything's coming out weird and it just reminds me of when I'm like nervous to tell a patient something and I just like really mess it up so bear with me I can't wait to put all the deco down I need some fun stickers though to go in this oh I missed one Jump call Oof! thank goodness I had enough blue ones Actually, I guess there's only two, so for each color. No, there's three for the yellow, so at least I planned it out okay. I had enough headers. Um, oops, not today. Let's do to 
do. So if you guys like see like orange splotches, I attempted a like fake tan with um like the Saint Tropez or Saint Tropez. I really don't know what it is, but um yeah, it might look a little splotchy. It was like the first time I ever tried it. It was really hard doing my makeup this morning because I didn't even take into account like the change of skin color until I was doing my foundation. Alrighty, so there's all of the headers and let's actually do like a day by day and I'll zoom you guys in. Okay, so like I said, I am working. So actually what I think I'm gonna do is keep color blocking. Um, oh, I should put these down. I'll put these, oh, I should have. It's okay, I should have color blocked the dates. Oh, you can't really see them, but I'm gonna be putting the day covers up there. They're super adorbs. Um, what I'm gonna do is use a half box, but I'm gonna put it vertically because honestly, you guys, like, <laughs> I don't do much when I have to work. Like, all I do is work and come home and we have dinner and just relax. We're so exhausted by the end of the day, but I'm gonna take a half box, so what I'm gonna do is just put it right in the center. Oh, it's not really that centered though. Uh, I hope that's straight, that'll do. And then I pulled out this sticker sheet from Clever Gal Crafts, which is SP1009, and I'm gonna use that because you guys know what it is. And I worked that day, so I will write down the hours. Um, and that is it for that day. I'm just like, I'll slide you up. Look, at least now you can see the date covers. Um, but -ba -da -ba -bum 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 -bum. I don't really know if I should use my littles or not, though. Hmm, da -dun, da -dun, da -dun. I'm trying to think. I like don't have any like packages and I don't think I want to track my meals to be honest. Oh, another interesting thing you guys, I found out why I had been sick all the time. I was diagnosed with celiac disease. So turns out that's why I ended up getting pancreatitis after my surgery. But I'm really happy I found out because since I've been eating gluten free, um, I also thought I was allergic to milk, like any kind of animal milk and like processed sugars, like cane sugars. So avoiding all that has been really hard, but I've been feeling really, really good. So if you guys are having any problems and you really can't figure it out, maybe try getting a food test. Like I'm not a doctor, obviously, but that really helped me. So just a, just a tip. Okay, so I'm gonna assume I have Tuesday off. So that is a day I think what I'm gonna do is do the sheets. So how do I wanna mark this? I think I wanna use one of these little flags. Yeah, cause I really think they're adorable. I think what I'm gonna, I just am so digging putting it in the center. Obviously we're going white space. So I'm gonna put that there and then, oh sweet, it's screen icon, the laundry machine is green. So I wanna put to wash the sheets that day. I hope you guys can see that. I know it might be a little bright. Um, and then, uh, I also really want to try making a recipe from my new cookbook. So, like I said, I've been on this new diet. So I work with a friend and she, well, I worked with a friend and she had the cookbook. You guys may have heard of it. It's very popular called Oh She Glows and Oh She Glows Every Day. And that's the second one. So I got the second one, which I believe is Oh She Glows Every Day. And I really want to try cooking from it. So I'm going to actually try on Tuesday because I'll have the day off so I can like actually go get stuff and try to cook it. And I will let you guys know, but I, I have tried the smoothie recipes and they are really, really good. So I highly recommend it already. <laughs> um, I want to try using some of these little headers too. Let's see. Um, okay, wait. What day? Seven, eight, nine. The ninth. Um... I think I'll do like errands. I'll put it just kind of like at an angle right there. I think that might be a little cute. And I also pulled out some fox and cactus stickers. Like I have like a little binder. You guys, there are so many, I have to organize my stickers so bad. Everything's in like bins right now. We've been like really cleaning and organizing stuff and it is such a mess in here. I have no stickers out. So I have this binder sitting here. So I'm just gonna see if I can pull something in, okay. So I think I'm actually gonna pull in these little coffee cups from Fox and Cactus because let's be real, they're so cute. I love her stickers and let's use, I never get to use the yellow one, I feel. Let's put like, just like that, like screw it, who cares, man. I did it! And then I'll just like put some deco. Let's put like a little surfboard, that'd be kind of cute. Put like a 
a little pink surfboard. You know what? That's pretty darn cute. I like it. I don't care. Um, <laughs> Wednesday, I don't. Like, I might be working these days because I might pick up some temping shifts. So if that happens, I'll have to fill it in. But for now, I'm not. So what I'm going to do... Man, like, I don't know. Maybe... Oh, you know what I should do on Wednesday is a Costco run. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going <laughs> to... Yes, I keep saying it. I'm like, you know what? You know what I'm gonna do. You know what I'm gonna do? That's what I did. And I put down a half box. So I'm gonna do that and then I'll use her little grocery cart. Oh, it's so cute. We need to go to Costco Plus. If you guys also are trying to find gluten-free stuff, Costco has a lot of stuff. Definitely check them out. <laughs> not promoted by Costco. It was not paid to mention Costco. <laughs> okay. Um, now what? So that's like all. I think I'll just leave it like that. I'll flip you guys over. Let's go to the next side. Okay, so I do work on Thursday. Oh, I guess both of them will be dark blue. That's okay. So it'll be at the top. We'll just center it again. This like sticker sheet from Clever Girl Crafts though matches this kit so perfectly, I think. Well, almost perfectly. I think it works very well though. So yeah, I'll be working. Is there anything else? I'll put those date covers on. Mama's day. Okay. My brain is so scattered right now. It's like 8 at night on Thursday. And I just was like, let's plan. <laughs> I don't know. I just felt like it. You guys get it, right? Right. Okay. One more date cover. Come on. Focus on me. Focus on me. There we go. That was really... No! I got, like, color block happy. <laughs> and I mixed up the days. Good thing I noticed. Who saw that before I noticed? Be honest. Who saw it? Who's still watching and saw it? <laughs> there we go. Okay. Doesn't that, like, drive you crazy, though? It's like, it was so perfect, and then these two flipped. And I'm like, why? Actually, it wouldn't have worked there anyway. Never mind. I'm just being ridiculous. Okay, so... Nothing is like planned, except for Mother's Day we will probably do something. Let's do it like... I'm just like dying over these little like half boxes going vertically. I don't know why. I'm just really feeling it today, so here's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna put the flag up here, we're gonna put the half box there, a little uh... I actually really like that. And you know what else we're gonna do? BAM! Heart in the center! That's for you, mom. Hope you're watching. She's not. I'll have to send her the video link and explain to her how to open it, but that's okay. No, I'm just kidding. Mom, I'm kidding. I know you can open a link by yourself. I love you. You got this. Okay. Um, wait, let me look for another cute sticker. I'm just, I could use, I don't want to use the Clever Girl Crafts ones because those are always like work. I'm always like, work, 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 work. Oh, you know what I can use is one of these family time ones. That's what I wanted to use. I'm like literally wearing a mask that peels out my pores right now. Not that you needed to know that, but it's like drying off my face and I kind of love it. Okay, that's adorable. You guys can't lie. That looks really cute. So at least that's in there. Um, do I want to put anything? Yikes, I have no idea what else to put. On the 11th, there is a bill due, and they do have more of these, so I think I'll put it right here. And, oh, I'm also hanging out with Claire, my friend Claire this day. Let's do, what do we have? <laughs> Exclamation mark. Let's use this flag. It's the fun Fun Claire date. Wait. Eh. Okay, there we go. She'll probably come over after work, I'm guessing. So we'll put that there and let's use I don't know, I don't let's use like a little surfboard. That looks so cute. You can't you cannot deny. Okay. Um I'm actually like living for this. This looks so adorable. I don't know what else, you guys. Like, maybe... 
Oh, I know what I need to do. On Friday, I should email Atco Gas. No, not Atco, and Max. I have to get my meter exchanged. They're like emailing people telling us it's that time to email them and have them exchange it. And I did it, but I didn't realize I had to be home, which probably seems stupid to a lot of people, but I didn't know that. So sorry, Atco. I mean, Nmax. Wait, Atco. I don't remember. Oh my gosh, this is why I need to learn to be an adult. So that isn't, is that straight? I don't care. Um, and I think I'm just gonna leave Saturday open. So let me just zoom you guys out and we'll do our sidebar. Okay guys, I'm actually like so stoked on how this looks so far. I think it is super, super, super cute. So let's just turn this to the side and we'll do our sidebar. Um, so the side headers I have are this week, next week, school, and work. So, um, I think I'll use work as my first one because I want to just track if I the exact hours, especially if I'm temping at all next week. So I think I'll use, oh my gosh, this kit is like, it feels ancient because I haven't used, well, it doesn't feel ancient. It just feels empty because like it's so old. You're so used to having all these like sidebar stickers. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, we'll just do this checklist. It's gonna be mostly like a decorative sidebar, I just realized. It's okay. And I really just like love this washi. So let's just put some down and start throwing on some deco like we don't give an F. Ball and chica. Okay. Okay. Um, more. <laughs> It's just like the skinnier these washes just get, the harder it is. Oh, credit dropped. Oh, see? Did I not say so? Jeez Louise. This is embarrassing. Baby, I do this. I thought that you knew this. Oh, thank God that landed that way. This is when paranoia and fear start to set. Oh man, that didn't even match up, the pattern. Who can say? Okay. Oh, so I don't have any full boxes, I thought I did. See, this is how you used to, to like, those kits you get. <laughs> um, what should I do? Okay, oh, I could do a half box. Let's do, I wish I had a blue. Let's do a yellow. Um. I'm gonna put it there and then I'm gonna put one more strip of washi to separate it. Let's use like this blue. Just to have a little separation. I don't know what I'm gonna eat. That is so ugly down there. It's like so uneven, but I don't care. Okay, so here is the full spread. I gotta figure out, let's do like, whoa. That's adorable. Mm, 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 mm. Why am I singing like that? What the heck am I doing? Like, I don't know. Well, now, Jessica, you have to make it work. Okay, it works. God damn it. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just am so upset. <laughs> no. You know, it, it, it's, it's preserved. <laughs> ah, yeah. Sorry about that, guys. That's so embarrassing. You know how it is. And then, yeah, we're just gonna do that. So, what do you guys think? Is there anything else I wanna add? Okay, I'm gonna put this for Sunday's dinner with Paul's mom with Doug. And yeah, so. This is it, you guys. I'm actually really excited, and I hope you guys, like, don't judge me for opening. Actually, no one's going to judge you, but I hope you guys are nice about it. I know you will be, but I hope you guys understand, and I'll just try to put up as many videos as I can whenever I can. I don't want to, like, stick to a schedule right now because this is driving me freaking crazy. That just turned out horrible. Oh, God, let's put something over it. I just completely ruined this exit. Let's put a recycling because... 
you need to recycle your bad sticker mistakes. Anyway, um, I really hope you guys understand. And if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you guys enjoyed this and my, any of my older videos, make sure you subscribe, subscribe <laughs> to check out some new ones. And I love you guys so, so, so much. I will hopefully be seeing you soon. Bye.